apologies, sir. I have 13 warrants to execute on the estate. I hope your witness was worth it. Uh, the witness proved um, unreliable, sir. Claims not to have seen anything. Pity. Sir, I don't think Harry Brown is a witness. I think he's our chief suspect. I'm sorry, I was under the impression Uniform found an elderly gentleman on the tape line. Yes, that's right. That's correct, sir. Mr. Brown is a close friend of Leonard Atwell, the senior citizen found stabbed in the pedestrian subway. It's the same pedestrian subway where last night's shooting took place and both victims were questioned in connection with Mr. Atwell's death. It's too much of a coincidence that Mr. Brown just happened to be found so close by. So what you're telling me is this escalating violence is down to a vigilante pensioner? Yes. Do you have any evidence to support that? Not at the moment, sir, no, but I'd like to get a warrant so I can have Mr. Brown's clothes tested for gunfire residue. Where is Mr. Brown? He's in the hospital, sir. He's having trouble breathing. Emphysema. Also, Dean Saunders was found on that canal, stabbed to death. He, too, was questioned by myself and Hickok and then released. Did you know that Troy Martindale was shot in his car last night? Martindale was a major heroin importer. Two of Martindale's associates, who operate out of Curzon Street, were also shot dead a week ago. Neither of whom you've questioned in connection with the killing of this old man in the subway. Of course, you'd have known all this if you'd been at the briefing. He was with the Royal Marines, stationed in Northern Ireland. I had the MOD send me his old service record. Terry, give us a minute, please. I've had a request from Division. They're looking for an experienced officer to head up a major inquiry into identity theft. Your background makes you the perfect candidate. I've recommended you and they've accepted. Take the weekend for yourself, Alice. Good luck.